Hi. So what happened to me is that when I started to stream on OBS, I didn't know which was the best server. Because there is a long list of servers that you can find here. And I just didn't know which was the best one. But I found out that there is a tool called Twitch Test, that is by Twitch, in where you could put your key and then just find out by doing some short tests which one was the best one with quality and with everything. But then happened to me that I, uh, the server that was the best for me just wasn't available on my OBS. I couldn't find it on my server list. I was very confused, so I started to ask around the internet, but I didn't get any answers. Until someone said something about Twitch underscore ingest. So I was confused. Like, where can I find that thing? But I had an idea, so um, what I tried to do was going into the File Explorer, go into Windows, see, Program Files and OBS Studio. But in here, I couldn't find this file. And how do, do I know that? Uh, instead of searching every single folder, I just type in this box Twitch because it's part of the name of the, of the file. And I didn't get any results. I was honestly very confused because I was like, Maybe this guy is trolling, maybe he's, he's saying something like out of his ass, I don't know. <laughs> but then I had another idea. Maybe there is like another folder from OBS, like a user file. And the place you can find that is going to, again, Windows C, Users. This should be your name, by the way. And then Updata. Quick thing, uh, app data is a hidden folder. And the way you can see hidden folders is by going up, press view, and then press this box here, hidden items. You see that when I uncheck the box, app data is just missing. When I check the box, I can see app data again. Go into app data, roaming, and then into OBS Studio. And here I pressed the search box again and type Twitch again. There is no results right now because I already took out the file, this one. And after that, I just didn't delete that because, well, uh, I was scared that maybe that could mess up my OBS. Maybe it's messing it up, I don't know at the moment. I still haven't streamed. I'm just giving you the solution I found to finding the servers because after doing this, I closed, I closed down my OBS, boom, and open it again. I went into the server list again, and I will find every single server that was available on my, on my Twitch test, and that's the way I found um, the servers that were just missing in Twitch test. It's a very quick, quick tutorial. I'm gonna say this right now. I'm not an expert in any of these models. So do this at your own risk of messing up anything, okay? Don't delete this file here in case you need it later. Just keep it around. Put it in another folder, I don't know. And that's the tutorial. It's very quick. I hope it did work for you. <laughs> Bye.